Hello again guys, welcome back to Hammer and Anvil Gaming. This is my Total War Three Kingdoms Lubu Legendary Campaign. And sadly, Lubu is dead. De like died of old age. He's been I thought he might make it to the end. He died at 65, so really good innings. Um but yeah, now the faction has passed to his daughter, the daughter of the dragon, Lu Ji. So, we now need to do, we've got loads to do this turn, um, and we're going to do a bit of a cabinet reshuffle as well. So the majority of this faction hates Lu Qinglong and Lu Jiping. So both of them, who are on 100 in terms of happiness, need removing from this. So... Let's remove them from office. And now we have everyone being happy across the board, which is great. Um, let's make Lu Yang Zhi Zhen our faction heir, maybe? Yeah, I think she is pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I think I think that's fine, right? Because, yeah, let's do that. We're just moving her laterally anyway. Right, she's been made heir. And now we need to look at who's going to... Like, I can't imagine Yuan Chu gets on with everyone. No, he does not. Um, let's see if we can get Sun Quan in the post. So he doesn't like Chen Gong, Liu Ying Shan... Weiji or Chen Gong. Mm. Doesn't really add a whole lot to it either. Ooh, minus 5% corruption faction wide. Yeah, Yuan Shu doesn't get on with the faction air, so that's just not happening. Lady Me, steadfast loyalist, plus 10 satisfaction for all characters. That's pretty strong. Doesn't get on with Chen Gong. Wait, did I see Liu Zhang on that list? Where's Liu Zhang gone? Oh, there he is. So we can make Liu, add Liu Zhang here. Doesn't get on with the faction air. That's not ideal. Hmm. Okay, Chen Gong seems to be pissing off a lot of people that I want to add to this list. Weiji's at 100, so I could probably remove him as well. Wolf Lady Yan hates a lot of people. Zhang Mao, the friend to all, plus 10 satisfaction. Oh my god, he hates everybody. Uh, 
Yeah, we've got quite a few options. Daughter of the Southlands. Hmm. Okay, yeah, right. For now, let's remove from office Chen Gong. And then we'll bring in, uh, where's she gone? Lady Me. It can be the Grand Excellency of the Works. So she'll like immediately add a ton of satisfaction. Yeah, she's adding loads. Sun Quan can become the Imperial Chancellor, I guess. Yeah, one shoe can't go there. Let's make Sun Quan the Imperial Chancellor. Oh, it's literally just Lu Ji. Uh. Weiji is just a general, so we can remove him from office with no no penalty. For, um, and then this is one of our daughters. Um, we could probably remove her from office as well, no problem. Okay. So, potentially... Could move up someone from what's Lady Feng got? Tactician. Partisan. Liu Jinyan, peacekeeper, plus four public order faction wide. Hmm. Who else is in the family tree who might be decent choice? Dong Hu Yi. Who is married to one of them doesn't get on with the air <laughs> who else Liu Jinyan I think I checked her yep she would be a decent choice yeah let's actually put her there
Ja Chi, who's actually a member of our family. Be the Minister of Ceremonies? Yeah, why not? We don't actually have anyone who's unhappy, which is really cool. Jiao Chen does not get on with Lady Me. Oh, so close. Liu Min could also join. Let's make her the Minister for Justice. Liu Shang? Yeah, okay, cool. Awesome. Right. Now comes the part where we need to start actually giving these people equipment. So we definitely want one of these. So let's try and take one from... Wait, hang on. So Liu Yangjin is the one who's still who's our heir. So we don't want them. Um, Sun Quan needs one of the books from one of the others. Liu Jiping. Although every time I do this, it removes it from the long, wrong person. Oh, it seems to have worked this time. Cool. And now we need to borrow a eunuch from the same person. Let's do it from Liu King Long. And now Lady Mi is also in our court, so there she is. Yeah, I think it's doing that weird bug. Oh, did he never actually have one in the first place? Okay. Remove that for now then. Uh, no, it's not going to let me, is it? Okay, that's fine. So, on... Where's she gone? Lu Jiaping. Need to remove this eunuch. Can leave her with this gear. Um, and then Liu Jinyan needs some stuff as well. She is now super happy. Let's give her um, 
one of those axes from someone else. Let's remove it from Lu Kinlong. Give me that axe. And we'll also need... Uh, where is it? Here it is. One of these from Lu Ji Pink. Just add stuff for the time being. She needs Han and you, one of. She needs some stuff as well. Yeah, that's not gonna work this time around. So many characters. <laughs> so many characters. Right. Remove that. Let's give you just a regular sword for the time being. Regular armor for the time being. We'll give her more gear later, but for now we don't need to. deployed okay interesting so who's still got a eunuch or something ah, I think that's I think that's everything now um, cool right what assignments are going where assignments not recruiting Okay, so this place needs upgrading. Po Yang could do upgrading as well, though that's half our money this turn. Call back that assignment. And let's get to moving armies. Let's see if we can chase down this guy some more. Can't run forever. Uh Okay. Right, well they've fled. So let's move you on shoe across here. Oh, is he going to try and leg it across the river? Let's ditch this. Let's 
do Dongzi here. Um, hmm. Okay, this is just straight up trespassing. Um, let's go deal with the yellow turbans. There's a lot of yellow turbans down here. Um, let's do some recruiting here for Liu Zhang's army. Some more of those. Uh, get some more... Let's get some Defenders of Earth and then two, another crossbow unit. And then Liu Zhang can have Imperial Household Cavalry, some Jade Dragons, and I doubt I can afford anything else. Just about afford some of them as well. Oh, and Sun Quan could start the move down here to take Ba. Okay, let's teach these bandits a lesson down here. Uh, that's not going to be interesting to watch, so I'm just going to delegate that. Let's maintain momentum. Go along here. Let's ransom the captives. Okay, it's given us a bit more cash to, to work with. Uh, let's move back up to Taiyan. Move Diao Chan. Can't quite reach. G Link can come and help. Okay, where else have we got assignments going? Ah, Zindu. Would be really good if we can build there, but I doubt we can afford it. Nope, we cannot. Where else? Jiang Yang and Shu. Which are places we built over here. Cool. Our family tree's probably a bit wacky now. Um,
，我们还有什么可说的？好的，请讲。真是浪费时间。I could just annex someone soon. Yeah, still haven't seen these characters, so I don't know if they are actually going to be spawned again. Would be good if they were, but I don't think they are going to be somehow. Let's delegate this. Okay, he ranked up. Let's do passion. And then Wei Ji can try and deal with her. Oh, okay. Oh, well, that was a huge mistake. Retreated right next to reinforcement range. Uh, that's a delegate. Hida, the general. Uh, let's release him. Let's maintain momentum. Yeah, let's move there, and we'll set up an ambush, just in case Sensei feels cocky. Yes. Yep, let's build this here. It's annoying because a few of these armies are trying to just slip through the net and get round us. Yeah. Oh well, that's not really something we can deal with right now. Okay, hope you enjoyed this one guys. Please remember to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next part.